I am not gonna lie when it comes to drugstore product or affordable product my heart just skips a bit not being dramatic but I'm a firm believer that you get what you pay for coming to think about it I'm not saying like the product that are affordable are any less than the luxury one because to be honest there are products that are shittiest when it comes to luxury ones as well and when people say that why don't you make like affordable skincare video you know girl your skin is investment okay you gotta spend and invest in your skin to get that glassy glowy skin look I mean like you can get it from Vaseline but then as you go start to older you know what I'm trying to say you can't just get it from Vaseline and also like yes Vaseline it's it does a very good job it depends on your skin for some people it just does not work but at the end of the day if you want like glowy healthy looking skin Vaseline mm -mm, it's not gonna do anything much than just giving some moisture in your skin have I even done my introduction yet hello guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new to my channel i am rajani gurung i make makeup videos so if you like to see what i come up with in the future then please make sure that you subscribe to my channels and then if you want to get notified every single time then you just have to click that bell button down there and then you get notified every single time that i upload so let's just start with our video i'm gonna do my affordable makeup look today and i'm so so excited about this video you guys have no idea when i thought about making this video i i wanted to make sure that it is affordable but at the same time it is good as hell okay i did mention in my instagram story if you have any good products that you have been using or if you want to try any product please let me know so that i can use it and so there were so many recommendations and i was like blown out hyped up okay but you know what i can't just put all those product in one video because it's gonna end up being like one hour video and i don't want that to happen so i thought that i would come up with the best one and put it forward to you guys and i have tried and tested this product before doing this video just to make sure that if it lives up to what the review are and what the hype are and also at the same time the price point okay that's the main point here by the way i'm gonna go for like a very healthy glowy skin i think that's on trend right now so i will give you the best out of it so let's just start with our video then so i'm gonna start off with a primer now when i talk about primer it's not exactly a primer it's actually a glow mist and it's from pixie i've used this before in my video so it looks like this can you zoom please thank you right there let me just shake that up and mix all this thing up it is a glowy mist so it kind of gives that healthy glow to your skin i was shook this is really good not as good as the tatcha one obviously price point is there it does give that same amount of feeling to it but Tatcha is obviously much more luminous so I'm just gonna spray this all over my face as a base so there you go now let's move on to the foundation as L'Oreal 2 matte foundation and this thing is amazing okay L'Oreal obviously they just do that thing when it comes to foundation or base any base so my color is in golden almond i'm just gonna apply a few drops on my hand and then i'm gonna use my beauty blender oh my god let me just go and grab my brush i don't know about you guys but i feel so good after i get my clean brushes there you go oh my god my foundation is flowing i always use like luxury product i wouldn't say luxury product but there are so many good products in the market right now like you can't think about one you know like one is good for one thing and one is good for another thing why am i looking so dark let's do this okay and um i never think about like affordable ones like i don't know why just it's just like being like that you know and after like getting to know so many things from you guys as well like the good product i was so excited to try all this product and see what it looks like and i can't believe that some of them are like really really good ones oh by the way um most of this product i have already tried but some of them are still new but i know that they are really good ones because i've seen so many reviews and everything and i have like swatched a little bit and it does feel so 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 good so yeah really excited for this video and hope you guys are as well oh my god i'm already loving that 
finish and I'm not gonna lie that foundation it does take away the glow from your skin a little bit and especially this kind of foundation because dark sure foundation are a bit towards the matte finish rather than the glowy finish so don't worry I'm just gonna spray that glow mist again back again and then make everything work you know oh by the way there is this foundation from makeup revolution that people want me to try it and I did try it I mean like swatched it and the minute I swatched it I didn't like it so many people think that it's really good but also at the end of the day it depends on what his skin is like my skin is more towards drier so I look for foundation which are more dewy rather than you know matte I came up with this one and I really really like the finish it's still still not a matte to a point where it just takes away all the glow but it does take a little bit out of it okay moving on to the concealer i have got it from the same line which is l'oreal true match it looks like this there you go and why not right from the same line it's gonna look amazing then uh, but then i want to try the one from morphe it's really really good okay i have tried it and it's really good but i thought that i will end up having only morphe in my video which i don't want it to happen and i think as much as l'oreal is available everywhere i don't think morphe is available that easily compared to the l'oreal one so i want to make sure that when it comes to base it is like easily available for everyone and also it's good okay i'm not just throwing it because it's affordable and easily available but it is good one hell of a good product so this is in the shade ivory ivory yeah and the good thing about this product is that it does not kick up you know some of the concealer it just kick up and then that drills on your fine line and it just you know like brings out that pores more visible instead of hiding it but it's not that heavy you know what i, I mean like it's not cakey but at the same time it's full coverage and has a beautiful finish i love it yeah so i'm gonna set my face with this which is maybelline fit me matte polish pressed powder and it's in the shade natural ivory which is 105 and comes with a sponge like this which I never use it I just throw it away or it just stays in there forever until I just throw away the whole thing out you can use that as well but I'm just gonna use my beauty blender just to get that product right there and I'm not gonna dab it like all over my face because my I already told you my face is all towards more towards dry side so I like to keep it as dewy at as dewy as possible can i speak today because it has been a minute that i haven't made a video and i'm finding it so difficult and also i just spent like an hour adjusting all the lighting and everything and it just it's just already like i'm feeling lethargic okay but what i like to do is before i put on the powder i just like to go back again with my beauty blender on the other side and i'm just gonna tap it in all the product so that the product are not building up on the crease so i make sure that i'm tapping it and then after that i'm gonna take the powdery side and then quickly press the powder i kind of crease on my my lines and also on this side and a bit on the forehead and i think that's pretty much that i'm going to apply this powder on because i don't want my face to be matte i'm gonna take my glow mist again and then i'm gonna spray it one more time all over my face so that it just brings that glow back since we're done with that i want to move first on to the bronzing and highlighting part so this is the palette and oh my god before even coming for me okay just just know why i have this product in here so this is benefit cheerleader bronze squat palette and when it comes to benefit i know it's not that affordable but but okay let me explain let me justify myself here when i saw this palette this was to be exact 50 pound uh, so i know 50 pound is not affordable at all but but then da -da -dan, there you go so let me take that out i have used it before okay but i'm um, just like ocd freak where i just like to put everything perfectly everywhere uh, okay so you get one two three four five product 
you know how long the hula has been in the market and still like one of the best selling bronzer because it is that damn good and you're getting that and not just that the hula caramel oh my god it is so good perfect for my skin tone and i'm pretty sure it's perfect for so many of you and the coralista blush uh, uh. and gold rush blush um when people say that this is highlighter this is not highlighter this is a blush with a little bit of sh shine and with a bit of a shimmery on it which is kind of like highlighter but at the end of the day it is a blush not a highlighter people think it's a highlighter but it's a blush and this highlighter which is cookie perfect for my skin tone so like I mean look at that look at can we not zoom on my face there you go look at that how good is that? These are like the most amazing product that you can get in one package, okay? And this is a good deal. And when you think about like £50, it's quite expensive, I get it. But when you think about the product that you're getting, five product here, which cost you like £10 each, and I think it's quite cheap because if you go and buy like just a hula bronzer, <clears throat> outside itself i think it costs around 20 plus pound which is like you're getting it in like half price here and everything is put together so it's like really travel friendly you can take it you've got blush bronzer highlighter everything in there so why do you want to buy go and buy any other thing you know it is like the best deal you ever get and the quality amazing the quantity of product you get amazing benefit is amazing so Come on guys, like why wouldn't you pay for like 50 pounds for this? I'm not thinking about this. I'm gonna go into this and use the Hula Caramel today. And I'm gonna use it with my Morphe White Full Brush. I'm just gonna take in the product. There you go. Hula Caramel has been out for a minute and I never thought of trying it. Like, I don't know. I just love the Hula Bronzer itself. It's so good. I never thought of trying it, but when I got this palette, I was like one happy kid okay so i tried it as soon as i got it and oh my god i think this is much better than the hula one when it comes to my skin tone so i'm so happy that i got this palette i kind of like my bronzer to go a bit higher here so that it just kind of gives that effect of lifted face you know what i mean lifting baby lifting Oh, by the way, about the foundation, oh my god, I was so scared to try this foundation today because can we talk about the weather right now in the UK here? Oh my god, it is so freaking amazing. The summer is here, so I've been going to the beach non-stop every single day because Arlop likes to go to the beach and we've been going to the beach like non-stop. So I have got a little bit of tan on my face, which I like it. But at the same time, this foundation, I bought it like a few weeks ago. And I was like, oh my god, I was a bit lighter during that time. And I don't know if the foundation is going to match it or not. But obviously, I knew that I, I could make it work. Because when it comes to foundation, you might want to go a bit lighter. And then you can bronze it up the whole face and make it look, you know, snatched and lift it and then moving on to the highlighter i'm gonna go into this shit Ooh, cookie why not right why not i mean cookie come on why are you so good i'm gonna look at that glow guys a little bit of down the nose bridge a little bit on the forehead and a little bit on the chin because why not so moving on to the bronzer, I'm going to mix this two, which is Coralista and Gold Rush. Mix this two together, like so, and then start applying right on my face. I'm moving on to the eyebrows. Why do I have to be so extra? I'm so excited for this. Are you guys ready for this? Moving on to the first one, which is from the Soap Brows. And this is a soap. If you don't have this, you don't have to use this. It's just a soap, okay? Um, you can use any soap that you have in the house. You All you need is fully. Just spray it with the water. Or like what I do is I spray it with Fix Plus because I am lazy AF and I don't want to move my ass up there and you know put on the water and then come back here and then start doing everything mm -mm. Mm -mm. so i'm just gonna 
like I said, I'm just going to spray the Fix Plus and then I'm just going to dip my brush in there. And then I'm going to start to work this on my brows. And if you have a very thick brows, oh my god, this is like a blessing for you. You can use only this product. It's going to lift your brows. Um, I think I have quite a decent amount of hair on my brows. But I do have some spa areas which I need to fill out. So I need other product as well, which I'm going to let you guys know later. But first, let's just get it done with this one. So I'm just going to use this to lift up my brows and as you can see how amazing this is i mean like this is so amazing this is the only product that i use nowadays let me just come closer to you guys what i'm trying to say can you see how lifted my brows are compared to this one this is like completely flat this one is lifted this is what we are talking about now because it's all about boy brows and lifted brows so i am just living for this one so like i said my i have some spa area so i'm gonna use this next product which is from the maybelline and it's called tattoo brow looks like so this has a little bit of that thing going in that is like a fork in that but this really helps to give you the streak of line on your eyebrows you know like instead of going with the brush it's like really consuming your time this one it is so much easier it saves your time okay trust me so what i like to do is just go with this one and just give the stroke of hair it's like a hair like effect what i'm trying to say is so i really really love this right now so i'm gonna use this on the spa areas of my brows and yeah so this is my brow situation right now and oh my god i am in love with it it looks so natural compared to those one you know and oh my god can we just get over the ombre brows like people do ombre brows i don't know why like who has ombre brows in real right who has ombre brows in real? Why are people doing ombre brows? Anyway, I just love this. These are bushy, full-on brows that are more looking like natural at the same time. But at the same time, mm, love it. So, right, moving on to the next part, which is the eye part. So, when it comes to the eyeshadow, oh my god, there are so many eyeshadow in the market. And when you think about like affordable ones, but at the same time, the good quality ones, I think about Morphe. I wanted to go back to the Morphe palette, but I think I used it last time in my... Wait, what did I just get here? So last time in my last affordable video. So I want to make sure like something else. So I was thinking about Colourpop because their eyeshadows are really good. But then um, I wasn't just getting the vibe from their palettes, you know, like I want to make sure that it's quite affordable, but at the same time quality. But then the color combination of that they had in the palette, I just wasn't feeling it. So I was just thinking about it, like what could it be? Then my mind hit BH Cosmetics. Now BH Cosmetics, when it comes to their eyeshadow, they are getting just better and better when it comes to quality. So I was thinking about it and then this is Take Me Back to Brazil palette. This is 35 color press pigment palette. So look at this amazing color. Like no one can go wrong with it. You have that black is black right there if you need it. You have the white. You have all the color that you want to play around. And it does have that transition color and everything. I'm just loving and living for this palette. I want to keep this more about like skin. The glowy skin with more natural finish. You know like the red carpet. Like it's all about skin. You have that glowy skin. A little bit of color like red lips usually. And then very little color on the eyes. But at the same time you look bomb so that is all about it so i wanted to make sure that everybody can wear this look so i'm gonna go a little bit of less when it comes to the eye but let's just get started for the transition color i'm gonna go into this color which is a bit of reddish brown so i'm just gonna put this on the crease of my eyes and i'm just gonna take this color and a little bit of take that color out because this color are really pigmented and I don't want that heaviness on my eyes. So here on the crease, I'm just going to apply it. And like I said, I don't want much color in it. So I'm just going to go very, very lightly. 
and then after that I'm gonna take this color which is bright yellow and I'm gonna use the same brush and then I'm just gonna go on top of that crease right there that we just created I'm gonna take off that color a little bit on my hand and then start just blending that color together After doing that, I'm going to go into my brown eyeliner which is from the Rimmel and it's called Soft Coal and it's in the shade Sable Brown. Looks like that. So I'm going to start off from the outer corner of my eyes, slowly there. And I'm going to wing it a little bit. Like so. And then draw it throughout your lash line. It's okay if it's not the cleanest line you have because we're going to blend this again. So I'm going to take my shader brush and then I'm going to go back to the palette and take this black sh blackest shade right there. And then I'm just going to go on top of that eyeliner and just try to blend everything in together and smoke it out a little bit, not too much, but a little bit, just so that... We have a little bit of smokiness going all around there, you know. And I do have to tell you about this palette that you will find a little bit of fallout in the products. So just be prepared for that. But other than that, the color pigmentation is really good. It's just that you get a little bit of fallout, which is totally fine with me because usually it tends to be like that. I mean, like, what can you expect, right? You get the product, you get the quality, everything. So I don't mind a little bit of fallout. When it comes to lower lash line, I'm not going to do much on it because I want to keep it clear. So I'm just going to go in with my this nude eyeliner. This is from the NYX and it's called Wonder Pencil and it's in the shade medium. So come on, zoom in. There you go. Okay, now moving on to the mascara. <clears throat> now, <laughs> you know that I've talked about my eyelashes a million times in this video that um, they don't exist okay they don't exist I like to call it that way now I was I was like oh my god mascara like I hardly use mascara because it does not make any much difference to my eyelashes so I always end up using falsies so um, I was thinking like people people don't have much like they don't want to spend much on falsies you know but I'm gonna use falsies today but still the um, I was thinking about like what mascara is there and when you think about mascara Maybelline they do like so amazing mascara that people are always raving about it but but the thing is that I don't feel any difference with all those kind of product as well so my cousin she just messaged me saying that oh my god you should try this mascara from the brand essence and it's so amazing everyone is talking about it you should try it and see how it works so that you know i can let everyone else to know how i feel like because if it works on my eyelashes then i'm pretty sure it works on your eyelashes as well so i was like okay let's see what is all this about okay so i started googling it and then i saw so many review and e uh, I mean like obviously there is always like bad reviews as well right I think uh, I get it why because I've tried this and I do like it it does make a little bit of difference it does I wouldn't say that it doesn't but I mean the amount of product that you get with the price I mean nothing can beat it okay nothing can beat it and I think that's why it has become so popular right now and this is the one from Essence and it's called oh my god let me tell you first Essence has so many mascara like there's so many you can choose from but I really like this gravitate me okay so this is the call uh, lash extension mascara so which has lengthening fibers so I was like okay now this might give something to me okay so this looks like this first coat that I'm gonna go in I don't know if you can see me on my upper lashes or not because my eyeliner is quite thick so it kind of does not show right now um, but it does make a difference but you can see on my lower lash line compared to this side it shows something like it it makes you feel like that the eyelashes is there okay so I do like the fact that it gives me 
uh, something. The price point was three pound or something like that, and I'm mean, like three pound you get this product and i have tried this before and just to see that if it's live up to what the vibe is all about and i loved it i mean like it lasts all day long i'm not kidding and also it doesn't smudge or anything like that i would rate it like 1000 out of 100 if that makes sense you know it is that good okay and i think if you have uh, quite a bit of amount of like eyelashes then it will look amazing on you but then mine <laughs> i need my lashes so moving on to the lashes i'm gonna use these lashes from audio and it's called wispies and this is the limited edition one and you know which one it is it is from the denny one looks like this and i love this lashes this is quite similar to demi whispers but at the same time it has got quite a volume more than the demi whispers one and i really really love this one because demi whispers i mean like most of the people prefer that especially for the bridal but i like dramatic lashes okay so demi whispers uh, if I wear those one I have to go I have to put on like two demi whispers together and then put it on you know so I think this is what they have done like they have worked a little bit on that demi whispers and added a little of volume and bring it to this one like voila amazing one so I really really love this one and also I support Danny quite a lot he is from UK and he's doing quite good I'm just gonna put on this lashes and show you the difference that it gives because it is not to a point where it's like baba boom kind of lashes that I usually wear but also it's not like subtle where you can't see anything so it's in between so it's like perfect one so if you can you can just grab it as quick as you can because it's a li limited edition one and this is i got it from super drug i'm thinking i may be wrong but i i'm pretty sure i got it from super drug um you can get it online i don't think uh, they have it anymore on shops because i have never seen it on the shop flow and so i just grabbed like bunch of it like dozen of it i already have them because i just love the way they look so yeah i'm just gonna pop them on quickly and yeah show you guys how it looks like so there you go guys i have popped on my lashes and it is not as dramatic as the one that i usually use this is the most natural looking but most amazing eyelashes okay you should just go and grab it so let's move on to the lippies yay for the lippies i have oh my god i want to use the one from morphe morphe liquid lipstick oh my god hands down hands down it is so amazing if you want to grab like a really nice color i don't think they have much color selection when it comes to the liquid lipstick but it's really really good okay and also this one color that i have which is called peanut which is like this looks like this whenever like i'm out like people are like complimenting me and like people are asking oh my god what color is that it looks so lovely on you and everything like that so this color mm, this is my go-to color right now but again i don't want to use morphe as much as i can in this video because i love all the morphe products so anyway i want to use this product which is uh from the what brand is this oh my god so sorry about it oh yeah this one is from lottie london and this one is glitter sweets lip color so i don't know if you have seen i I'm, I'm i'm pretty sure some of you have quite seen a bit of what this is all about so this is a liquid lipstick that you can just apply it as you usually do and then like you just have to wait for like a minute or something like that just to let it set and after that you just put your lips together and then when you open up ooh, the glitters and everything are just all over your lips it just comes out from that lip color and it looks so amazing you don't have to put any lip gloss on anything it is so amazing so i'm just gonna show you guys how it looks like and uh, by the way this is the one that they collaborated with uh Tui Lee. if you don't know she's very very insta famous but she's catching up in youtube uh, as well and she's doing quite well and i think I just love her being who she is and um, you know like she's just amazing and she's such a hardworking girl so I just look up to her as well so her name is actually X Twilly but uh, her real name is Twilly so 
Um, yeah, I'm just gonna use it. Oh, by the way, it looks like this. There you go. I'm just gonna start applying it with the wand that comes in and the wand is quite small so it's quite comfortable enough to get on the lips. So I'm just gonna start filling it. Ready for this guys? Let's get this. I don't know if you guys see that or not but it is so beautiful and I love this lip color on me and it's so stunning. I love the color and everything and that glitter, oh my god, that is giving, that is giving something to my lips. Alright guys, with that being said, I'm pretty much done with this video. I think I pretty much achieved that glowy look I wanted to and if you want to set it to your face, I please go ahead and set it with Pixie Glow Mist but I think it's a kind of glow that I already have it and I like it this way. So yeah, um, like I love all the things and to be honest, I really really love doing this video because it was kind of like testing and a trial kind of video knowing all the product you know like going out of my comfort zone and getting to know all this product and i really really enjoy trying this product and like also i want to make sure that i give like genuine review and at the same time i bring in those good products out there you know for you guys so that you can just go ahead and grab it and use this product for your daily basis because i use this product for daily basis nowadays and i really really love this and also not just that there are other really good products that i really wanted to bring forward but like i said this video is gonna end up being very long so I might do it in my next video but so far all this product I just love it and I'm pretty sure that you guys are gonna like it too so yeah I hope that you found this video helpful so that is it for guys if you're new to my channel please feel free to subscribe to my channel uh, I make sure that I upload every Thursday but right now I'm getting busy with the stuff going on on my private life so i'll try my best to you know just be able to attend tape a bit more here um so yeah that is it so i will see you in my next video and until next time stay beautiful and i love you all Mwah. how much would you rate mommy out of 10 mm, 100 <gasps> oh thank you that's enough rajni that's enough not too much. Mm. <laughs> does dot ah can I speak? But it does a decent size and also Well it does the same job, so you know, maybe next time just get those affordable products then. You really want to say that, didn't you? <laughs> you got to let it go.